Bienvenidos and hello! Welcome to Mondo Adventures. I'm Reina and I'll be your guide. On this episode, we're in Mexico! And we'll be traveling from Durango to Mazatlan. We head out on Highway 40 from Durango on a three-hour drive through the Western Sierra Madre. This highway is famous for the 115 bridges and 61 tunnels. It is considered one of Mexico's greatest engineering feats. Making our way into the Sierra Madre, we have already traveled through high desert and find ourselves surrounded by lush pines. Take advantage of places along the road to park and take in the beautiful mountain views. This three hour drive required a lunch break. So we made a stop at one of the many food stands along the road. We couldn't wait to try some gorditas. A gordita is a thick corn tortilla, deep fried and filled with a variety of fillings. Chicharron and salsa verde is Mondo's favorite. We recommend stopping and trying some. Refueled and ready to go after our lunch break, we got back on the highway and encountered one of the first of literally hundreds of bridges we will be passing over and through one of our first of many tunnels. When I said that there were many tunnels, our curious minds got the better of us. We found out that the tunnels are a combined length of about 10 miles. As we got closer to the state line leaving Durango and entering Sinaloa, we could see the change in vegetation those beautiful pine forests were ending and more tropical vegetation can start to be seen. As a kid, we played a road trip game, holding our breath from the start of the tunnel until the end. Playing that game on this tunnel might be hard. It's the longest tunnel coming in at 1.7 miles. Don't hold your breath for this one. We might not have held our breath for the longest tunnel, but our breath was surely taken away because as we left the tunnel, the views were majestic. The canyons with their vast green vegetation were a beautiful sight to be seen. We were able to get out and really take in this gorgeous view. We recommend that you stop where you can because there are a few places to do so. We didn't want to leave these amazing views, but we had to get back on the road. We were on our way to see the star of the show, El Puente Balarte, or the Balarte Bridge. It is the highest bridge in the Americas, boasting 1,300 feet above the valley floor and connecting Durango to Sinaloa. It is also the highest cable stayed bridge in the world. Unfortunately, like we said, there are few places to stop and really take in the beauty of nature and the amazing engineering feats. Nevertheless, our adventure is not yet complete as we make our way to the coast, making the descent from the rainforest of the mountains to the more coastal trees and plants. The drive was a little more than three hours with the stops that we had along the way. Well worth the extra time with all the gorgeous scenery we encountered. Some of our passengers were wondering if we were there yet. And yes, we are almost there. We have arrived. Matsalan, we are here. I, for one, was ready to enjoy this Pacific Coastal Resort City with its sandy golden beaches and warm weather, and our personal favorite, fresh seafood. There are plenty of beachside restaurants. Let us know if you've been to Matsalan and your favorite beachside restaurant in the comments below. None of our Mexico adventures are complete without taking a picture at the city sign. These are best for group pictures, by yourself, or the one you love. Ah. 
Hey, thanks for joining us on another Mondo adventure. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. See you at our next adventure.